So here's the uh, Olimex uh, development board that I found. Uh, it's uh, called AVR-MT-128. So it's based, based on an Atmega-128. So it's the same uh, hardware as an Arduino, but it's not quite an Arduino. You could, you could turn it into one if you wanted. Uh, no, it doesn't have the bootloader in it. Uh, the 128 is much more powerful than the 168, much more pins. And all pins uh, are either connected to something or you have access to them uh, on, on the outside connectors. So what I like is there's a screen right there. There are little buttons, so all the things you, you need. And uh, just a little buzzer, a little relay. Uh, so it's, it's, a, it's a good starting board. Um, also has uh, two, uh, two quarts, it has real time quartz and, and the 16 megahertz uh, quartz nice little board so to interface it with uh, the R2 electronics I made my own little breakout board uh, nothing more than a few connectors mostly straight through connections and it plugs right in see if I can do it while holding the camera no I cannot so I'll have to do it on my own setting the camera down there you go And now we're ready to go and play with the controller. So on here I have um, six servo outputs. I could have many more. Uh, actually as many as there are pins. So you could have uh, you know, tons of it. Uh, I have uh, six uh, channel uh, RC channel inputs. Uh, could have up to eight number of interrupts available here. And I, I uh, pinned four of the um, ADC input out. There's many more pins available, but I just uh, thought those were uh, good for my use.